My name is Jesus Martinez and I'm co-owner um, of Visionary CrossFit. Um, my wife Carrie Martinez is the second half of Visionary CrossFit. I used to own and operate a gym in California for several years before uh, I owned Visionary CrossFit. Um, we uh, sold that gym in California and we moved here to Gainesville and we opened up Visionary CrossFit. We wanted to um, create a space that was uh, totally different from any other CrossFit gym. Me and my wife were both artists, so we decided to combine our passions and open up a gym slash art gallery. So we feature art shows and artists, mostly local artists. We feature about 13 different local artists usually at any time and we also feature international artists like Alex Gray. But we're actually also a music venue and a dojo for martial arts. So this is about a year and a half that we've been here now. The turnout has been great. They're interested in art and you know they're working out in an art gallery which is unique. I would like to say that we're the first ever. Well, right now we, we have about roughly 50 to 60 um, paying customers and then every day we, we get more and more people um, signing up and we're expanding and getting bigger every day. We're on Facebook, we're on uh, Instagram. My Instagram actually um, has gotten a lot of attention from CrossFit headquarters for my whiteboard art because um, I do a daily drawing every day and uh, workouts are incorporated in my drawings. That's got the attention of CrossFit headquarters and they've, they've actually um, contacted me a few times. I've been featured on the Instagram. We're just trying to provide a space for transformation. Just, uh, we just want to tr create a space where people feel comfortable in doing CrossFit. Um, a lot of the times CrossFit gets a bad name, a bad rep for being uh, super hardcore, super intimidating. Um, so when me, me and my wife um, thought about this place, I let my wife do all the interior decorating, so she picked all the colors. Um, she, she, she came up with the layout of everything. Um, so we, we just wanted to be less intimidating, and we also wanted to cater more towards mom and pop and students. We um, redid this whole building. This, this, this was all falling apart. This was a, a hole in the wall. We painted some murals outside. The murals that you see outside are painted by myself and, and Carrie. We've also been commissioned by the city of Gainesville to do murals for them. So we have two murals, one in the high dive and downtown, and then one on South Main and Depot. My wife has been doing art all her whole life and I've been a, a street artist my whole life. Our specialty is surrealist art and visionary art. This is some of my work and, um, and we change it around all the time. So, as you can see, it's the gym and they're working out to the gallery of art, which really makes it cool. I'm from Miami, um, born and raised in Miami, but was living in California for the past 15 years and just recently relocated back to the East Coast. All my friends that graduated used to come here to university, so I would come visit them. This was about 18 years ago. I'd, I'd come here, hang out with my friends, and go to the springs, go to the forest. And, and that's how I know about Gainesville. So when we thought about relocating, our choices were either go back to Miami or Pennsylvania, where my wife is from. And with having two kids and all, we, we thought, let's, let's scout out Gainesville as a possibility. So me and my wife came for two weeks, um, scouted it out, and she loved it. And I figured, hey, you know, with the university being here and the students, um, I could open up this new gym with a new vision. Then we came up with, with the whole concept of fitness, art, and music. So the visionary fam, fitness, art, and music um, idea was born. And yeah, here, here we are. <laughs>